Mike, thank you very much for joining us. Um, how is your leg feeling? Are you 100%? And um, how do you expect to be used this season? Uh, first off, yes, 100%. <laughs> feel great. Um, second off, you know, <laughs> I don't think anybody knows what to expect this season. Uh, you know, and that includes me. So, you know, I'm ready to go. Um, excited to be back and you know that stuff seems to always kind of work itself out so whatever the role is i'm happy to fill it thank you james wagner go ahead and unmute you've got the next question hey mike what's up hope you and the family are well uh just like two questions first of all uh what does it just feel like to be playing baseball during this pandemic and just like all the measures you guys have to go through to get the season off uh, first of all start with that one yeah um i mean i'm excited uh, you know, I can only speak for myself, but, you know, um, being, being from Chicago and, and, and the, the um, strict stay at home orders and uh, kind of self quarantining um, that my wife and I did. Um, it's really exciting to be just kind of get out here and, um, you know, be with the guys and, you know, obviously uh, we're doing what we can and, um, you know, acting responsibly uh, to keep ourselves safe out here. But um, I'm excited to play some baseball and, and I really, I really, uh, truly believe that, you know, once, once the, the real games start, it's, it's, I mean, it's going to look like the baseball we've been playing forever. What were you able to do back home in Chicago? Were you able to find anywhere to hit and stay in shape? Um, so early in quarantine, I, I, I had, I bought a tee and like a catch net and I was just hit in the backyard a little bit. Um, and I'd work out at home. Um, we have just some very basic stuff, but you know, I felt like I was able to kind of just maintain uh, where I wanted to. And then as um, you know, a little bit of time passed, I was able to get into you know, a, uh, a private gym. And uh, you know, I felt that if I was you know, go in and, and wipe down the equipment I was using and um, you know, kind of try to limit my time there and limit my interaction, uh, I could uh, you know, safely work out and, um, you know, hit. Take the next question from Sweeney Murdy. Sweeney. Hey, Mike, are you finding that the pitchers are ahead of the hitters? Have you guys as a group talked about that? And is there enough time for guys who feel that way to catch up with two weeks till the opener? Yeah, I think Garrett Cole's ahead of everybody. Uh, <laughs> uh, he looked really good the other day. Um, you know, I think that's kind of what happens every spring training that, the, uh, um, now just in, in the, uh, some of the velocity prerequisites it takes just to pitch in the big leagues. Now, I think, uh, you know, the game's getting a little bit younger and guys are throwing harder. So, you know, whereas, uh, you know, even as back, as far back as like 2016, that was my first major league spring training, you know, guys were, uh, maybe it was a little bit more even early on, but now when, you know, you have. Um, some like 19, 20, 21 year olds throwing 98 miles an hour in their first live bullpen. I think the, hit, the pitchers are always going to have an advantage early. I mean, they always have an advantage as it is. Like if you get a hit 30% of the time, you're pretty good. So, um, you know, I think that these inner squads have been great. Um, you know, one of the uh, advantages to facing our pitching is that it's, you know, they're just running out all star after all star, elite arm after elite arm. So, um, you know, I think that uh, that's going to help us adjust pretty quickly. Um, you know, for when, for when, 